This is the plaster wrap method. And we're going to be using this material that they used to make casts out of um, when you broke your arm and stuff. And so this is like a cloth and they've got this stuff called plaster in, embedded into the fibers. To make it work, you have to dip it in water and smooth it around. Now it's kind of tricky. Um, so you can see I've got some little plaster strips. Don't make them any bigger than this because they get real floppy. You're going to see in a minute. And you want to get some warm water. Now, not hot, just warm. So what the procedure is, and I'm going to plan on where I'm going to start. Everybody wants to start up here, but I want you to start at the base. This is where my piece is going to be connected to the wood. So I want to secure this first so I can get them up on the wood and work on them a little easier. So I'm going to start down here. I'm not going to cover the wire, but I'm going to cover the foot and the legs surrounding the wire. And that's going to be my first goal for the day. So I only have a few strips. It's not going to take you, you're not going to be able to do very many in one class period because this is kind of, it's kind of tricky. So you dip it in the warm water and it's going to turn really floppy. And you can see I can smooth, it activates that powder and you can smooth it so it turns into more liquidy. And you got to be really careful and wrap it around and you can smooth it on some more. Take another strip. Dip it in the water, smooth the powder in, and then just carefully wrap the little strip. And it's not going to be easy. You're going to have to take your time. Take your time. You want it to be nice and neat because there's no do-overs with this stuff. And see how you can just smooth it? And I'm reinforcing this a couple of times, making sure I got a good, strong attachment to the wire. And all my plaster is nice and smooth. And now I'm going to cover the tip of that foot. So the smaller the area that you're covering, the smaller the piece you want. You don't want to try to wrap this all with one piece because you won't pick up any details and um, you'll have a lot of stringies which aren't very craftsmanship like. They don't look very good. So I'm going to do one more. I might even cut it just a little bit. This stuff cuts with scissors and I forgot to show you how to prep that, didn't I? So that's pretty good. It's a great start. I'm going to work on the leg, up on the leg a little bit more. I'm not getting out of the camera. Okay, I'm going to turn this off and see how it looks on camera so far.